hello and welcome to the final video in semantic DLO video series in this video you are going to watch deduplication backup in DLO for the demonstration I have one domain controller one DLO server and one Windows 7 client machine this demo cover how to configure a dedupe server how to configure the dupe storage location and how to backup and restore also and let us say something about the duplication the main aim of the duplication or advantage is to eliminate duplicate copies of repeating data for example you have 10 instance of same email and you just assume in a traditional way if you are going to back up all the files will be going to back up and the size of the 10 emails will be the size of your backup am I correct but if you have a duplication technology just assume how it will be working you have 10 emails with same instance and it all going to be a one copy so this is the advantage it eliminate the duplicate copy so how is dedupe in DLO works dedupe in DLO is source side deduplication so a source deduplication will advantage less traffic over the network and simply the entire file for the very first time is going for a dedupe backup and if there is a file change the backup automatically switch to delta mode let us watch a small animation on this you have 10 GB data and you enabled dedupe backup the first file system backup will be dedupe mode you will have 10 GB file in your dedupe storage location later you have a 8 GB data occupied on the file system out of the 8 GB 3 GB is only the changes the other 5 GB is similar to your 10 GB data so the next time the backup switch to Delta mode and it will copy only the 3 GB so instead of 18 GB you are going to store only 3 GB file in your dedupe storage so let us watch a demo on dedupe server configuration and backup to configure a dedupe server you have two options new dedupe server or new dedupe server using wizard name your dedupe server here give a small description enter your server name and click OK now a dedupe server is added right click and select manage to complete the dedupe storage location configuration you can see the dedupe storage pool here and there is a default storage pool available we will create a storage location with this default pool if you want you can create new storage pool also here so go to default storage location then select default dedupe storage pool click add name of the storage location and you need a network folder for dedupe so here mine is backup slash dedupe a username which have read and write access to this folder password here operation successful so now you created a dedupe storage location the next job is to assign this storage location to the network folder so right click on the network folder select properties and assign from the dedupe storage location after this this network folder is dedupe enabled now go to profile and select profile 1 and enable the dupe
so here we created a dedupe storage location we assigned it to the network folder then we enabled it in the profile profile one now we assign profile one to the user properties it's already assigned so click OK now go to the client machine and um, in this profile I selected only to copy back up the desktop folder so we copy some folders uh, to desktop to show you the backup and also the advantage of how the YouTube advantage here nearly 101 MP so as there is a file change in the desktop uh, semantic DLO will start now backing up the folder you can see the usage summary and also the size of uh, backup and also the progress here so this is the first backup job so here it is did you backup is going on now now the first backup is completed we can verify the backup job completion from the history also again come to the client machine I copy similar file from the same folder to a new folder so now there is a duplicate files here okay let's copy it nearly 25 MP so this backup is what called Delta mode because it's the changes are going to backup now now come to the server and select manage from the tube server and select default pool and go statics you will see the advantage of uh, the duplication savings so thanks for watching this video and I hope you enjoyed for more videos please visit niasitpro.com or my youtube channel tech l space